So what I wanna do today is just some trail maintenance. So I wanna get my tiller out and I want to tear up this grass and make it just straight dirt and pack it down. And then hopefully next year, whenever the grass starts growing again, this area will be all dirt and it'll be nice and smooth and ready to ride. All right, let's get the tiller out. Let's see if we can get this tilled up. Let's see if we can improve this section here, make this thing flow a little bit better and really incorporate it in with the trail system like I've been wanting to do for a while. Well, let's go. Been a couple days since uh, I cut this in. Yeah, that's just loose. So it might have just washed off the ground or off the sides here into here. All right, so I've got this all dug out now. It's looking really good. It's got some loose debris in it because it rained the last couple days. I want to add a feature over on the other side. So let's get started working on that feature. Let's head over to where I've got this massive rock that I want to put in the middle of the trail to make a sweet kicker. Yeah, look at that. Can we stick a rock under there to stabilize it? That looks pretty good. Heck yeah. It's gonna be fun. It'd be cool to put a couple of these down this trail since it's just a long stretch and just be able to go down and kind of hit a couple of them at a time. Feels pretty good. All right, got my little kicker in. It's the first of hopefully many. I think it looks pretty good. I've kind of uh, always thought of this section as being kind of some quick little jumps and uh, then we can give it a test ride.
you go. I am super stoked with how this turned out. The tiller worked really well. It was hard to manage just because it's just an old tiller. Basically, they made things back then with just brute force. There was no ergonomics to any of it. So yeah, it worked really well, cleared it up. I uh, got lots of dirt to fill in. A little uh, area in my yard worked perfect. Killed two birds with one stone. Also built this little, uh, I don't know what you call it. I've been calling it a rock kicker. I love having these type of features on my trail just because anybody that comes over, you can ride them and you can, you know, you can get a lot of air off of it if you really try, or you can just roll over it or roll around it. I think this build turned out good. It's always good to get some trail maintenance done. There's a few areas that I need to take the time just like I did on this one and kind of maintain them. But uh, leave me a thumbs up if you guys like this video. Uh, leave a comment below. Let me know what you think of it. What should I add to my trail next? If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. It really helps out my channel. Also, if you want, you can help support the channel by going over to patreon.com slash runbikemike and you can get in for as little as a dollar a month. And whenever you do that, you get some extra benefits. Plus you get early releases on all my videos. But as always, get out there, run, bike, build, and just have fun. We'll see you in the next one. She's a beaut. She's a beaut, Clark.